And we're back. Okay, and that little spider chases you. I forgot to mention that. Um, so there's this little spider that you might notice that start like oh starts behind you at the beginning of the level. And basically, what's going on is that uh, it's kind of like the screen pushing you forward. You can't go backwards. If you try to go backwards, it just where the spider is just stops you. It's it's an actual. Um, barrier and the spider will kill you so you can't kill the spider you can't do anything to stop it or slow it down it's just like the speed of the level is determined by the spider um, if you're able okay if you're able to do it faster then you're good if you can't then you're screwed gotta love the NES for that there we go oh damn you gavel forgot about the one that gavel there okay cool but you do get, you you do get time bonuses uh, if you do complete it faster. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. So, uh, as I mentioned last time, guys, uh, eh, this is gonna be a lot more audience participation sort of thing. I'm hoping you guys are enjoying this so far, because, uh, although I've let Vigo go apparently, one, two, three, four times now, <laughs> uh, New York still stands, you know, the, uh, the Republic lives on. Okay. Yeah, I I definitely... You know, the funny thing is, is that I, I've been to New York a lot. I mean, New York to me, it, uh, because that's where my girlfriend Alyssa lives, um, New York has become so de-mystified. Like, uh, I saw a thing on the... Uh, <laughs> or heard a thing on the radio. They were like, if you win our contest, you can win a free trip to New York. And I'm like, yay. <laughs> like, I wasn't, I wasn't even the slightest bit, like, impressed or interested with that. I was like, I'm like, yeah, wow, a trip to New York. Like, and I think that's bad. Like, I shouldn't be that, like, de-enchanted with it yet. But, like, over the past year alone, okay, yeah, just a full year, I have been to New York. Uh, I, I've been in New York for over, like, s if I add up all the weeks between the time I actually worked there and the time that I just went and visited, uh, I would say that I've been... Are you joking? Come on! I've been to New York uh, in for like seven months total. I, it's, uh, yeah, about seven months total, at least, out of the past like year, year and a like, couple months, whatever it's been. Um, it's ridiculous. I, I basically, New York is the second home at this point, so they're like, oh man, you can ride a subway! And I'm like, yeah, I ride the subway all the, like, I know the lines now. I don't, I mean, I'm not, like, an expert by any stretch, but, like, I can get around in New York and get to where I need to go without, without an issue. Like, it's not like a, oh, no, am I gonna figure out where I'm, uh, just, fuck that up. Um, where, where am I gonna go today? I'm like, I can go anywhere. It's not a big deal. It's just New York. But anyway, <laughs> it's kind of funny. Is anybody, uh, I'm sure you guys, like, maybe you have a vacation spot, a family vacation spot, or maybe you uh, yourself have a spot where you go to all the time that, um, you know, maybe to other people it's like, wow, that's so cool. But you're like, yeah, like, uh, say you're from Colorado. You know, oh, man, like, I want to go ski in Colorado. Colorado. You're like, you mean my backyard? It's not really all that. <laughs> all that exciting anymore. By the way, if you if you guys are uh, absolutely loving my frustration, then this is gonna be a great game for you guys. Okay, there we go, jump the car, do do do. Ghosty, 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 ghost. Oh, piss. Uh, by the way, do you guys like the fact that, that uh, oh, that's game, that's full game, good. Um, the ghosts have shadows, did you notice that? That the little car, <laughs> like the, when you're doing the car segments, the ghosts have actual shadows? Oh, I just love it. Okay, here we go. All right, this t this time is for real though, guys. Like I was joking around the last couple times, but this time I am gonna be all in, focused. U H still the, or maybe it's a V. Is that a V? Maybe it's a V. I never even considered that as a possibility. Like there's a lot of stuff in this game where I look at it and I'm like, you know. I'm just gonna take it for what it is and just move on. Like, like the fact that there are spiders that are just like floating. That, like, I, I don't know if they're they're supposed to be ghost spiders, actual spiders, because they were never in. There's a lot of spiders in this game in general, actually. Now that I really mention it, um, but uh, I I just take it. Oh damn it! Bounce. Yes. Yes. Oh, that was so clutch. 
Yeah. Screw you, head. By the way, those heads are from... Um, I called them Bouncing Vigo heads before, I think. But what they are is, uh, at that point in the movie, when they go down into the sewers, there are, like, heads on pikes. Uh, and truth be told, it was the scariest part of the movie, um, the, the second mo movie, that is, uh, when, when, you were, when you were a kid. Because, like, most of the imagery is, like, you know, car I want to say, like, real-life cartoony, if that makes sense. Uh, I hope it does. But, yeah, it's basically, like... You know, oh, it's it's silly, wacky Ghostbusters, and then like, suddenly there's like he real ass he heads on pikes, and you're just sitting there, just really kind of feeling a bit awkward. Yeah, suck it. Um, yeah. Oh, damn it! I was I was on a roll there. Um, but anyway, like uh, my my brother when we were kids, that was the one part of the movie that he couldn't watch because we used. Are you joking? I hate this because when you die in the in the car levels, no matter how far you are, look where you start at, guys. Right back at the beginning. But anyway, my brother couldn't watch it. He uh and and he, to this day, he swears up and down. Yeah, I could. I wasn't scared. Yeah, he, yeah, he was. He was absolutely terrified of of the the part with the heads on the pikes, because he he just he just couldn't do it. I, on the other hand, uh, like, like as the big brother, you know, basically was like, whatever, it's not scary. In my back of my head, I'm like, Jesus, what, 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 what is this? Like, like as a small child watching that, it like, it was weird. It was creepy. It was weird. I had never seen anything like it. Like, it didn't make sense to me. Hit it! Come on! I fired up like the super bomb, and it takes like 90 hours to go off. May as well just not even have the damn thing. Oh, God. Okay. There it goes. By the way, that timing on that jump is, like, if you don't get it exactly right, you die. Every freaking time. And for those of you who've never played this game before, I encourage you to play it. Um, I'm not really big into emulators, guys. Uh, I mean, don't get me wrong. If you if you don't have a game and you want to play it and you can, can emulate it, like these old NES games, and you don't have the resources to get to, to get it, I fully understand. I'm not trying to, like, when I always say I, I don't, like, go for emulators, I don't, I'm not trying to say, like, you know, you're a bad person if you're using emulator. I'm trying to say, like, I personally uh, have um, found it more fun to, like, collect the games and, like, like uh, doing the collection process. So, um, yeah. <laughs> so basically just, just, just saying that, it, you know, if you use an emulator, don't think I'm saying, like, you know, you're a bad person for using one. It's, uh... Uh, just a personal preference. All right, cool. We're on a roll. This is it. Yes, we we did it. We did it. That's all the that's all the jumping. It's just slimers now, and they, uh, they make the mm, yes. The red uh, the red shot here is the best thing to get. You know, it's better than the shield even. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Point, point, city, point, city, point, city. Yes. Oh my God, I'm so happy right now. So I, I was talking about my disenchantment with New York, and actually this kind of reminded me. Um, when I was a kid, New York was a magical place to me because it was where Spider-Man lived, and it was where the Ghostbusters lived. And I was big into both those guys, both of them. I mean, especially like, oh my God, when I was when I was in in the nineties. Um, there was this this awesome like Spider-Man cartoon I watched, uh, you, and I'm sure you guys all watched it too. The, the Spider Blood, Spider Blood, Radio after Spider Blood. It's like I think it was just called the Amazing Spider-Man, but basically it was freaking cool, and I love that. I love my Ghostbusters, of course, which was a little bit older than that, but I still loved it. Um, yeah, I just sniped that. I don't know if you guys saw that. Oh, this is something that's interesting. If the if the trap is still on the screen, you can't drop another one. So if you're wondering why I'm not like spamming traps, that's the reason why. Um, ooh, crap. But anyways, but New York was like this magical, mystifying place, and I got to go there um, for the first time when I graduated college. Um, as a graduation gift, my mother uh, took me to. Oh, I screwed that up. As a graduation gift from college, my uh, mother uh, took me to New York with, and her and I went there and we went through New York and it was the coolest thing ever. I, I was so like blown away by New York. Like I was just, wow, wow, you know, everything. Like I, I, I probably filled, I can't remember how many pictures it was like, but it was like, an, it was just a stupid amount of pictures. Um, 
when I went back there the second time, it was uh, le it was it was for work, and so I wasn't as as big in a sightseeing necessarily because I was there to work. But at the same time, since I had been there once before, I had kind of a base, and because I had that base, it was really t I'm all about that base, about that base, no treble. Damn it! I screwed that up. But anyway, uh, I was able to kind of go and just uh, see things that I had already seen before, but also kind of enjoy myself. But anyway, I'll talk about that more next time. Uh, oh god, I didn't even mention the other games. Well, I lied about that, and you guys will hear that next time when I come back and shut Vigo down in his lip snarl. Look at that. He looks Dick Cheney, right?